probably double checking what time we're meeting up today. I'll text her back. Once upon a time. Quickly, before we begin, I'm sorry I haven't been able to upload a video recently. I've had school and as you can see, now I've moved back to my house for the summer. I hope you enjoy this. Welcome you two travelers. Oh, is this a topic near and dear to my emotional sanity? For any of you who are like me, at least slightly introverted on top of being a visual communicator, I'm sorry, you have the perfect recipe for having social anxiety while talking on the phone. It might sound odd to be scared of talking on the phone, but apparently so many people have this fear that it has its own phobia, creatively named phone phobia or telephobia. Telephobia, isn't that just fun to say? Some people link phone phobia with the amount of texting millennials do, but personally, I've had phone phobia since before I knew texting existed. I've recreated an example for you from when I was like eight. <laughs> Emily, do you want pizza for supper tonight? Oh, sure. Oh, okay, then uh, go ahead and call the pizza place and ask for one pepperoni and one cheese. But, oh, you have the number. It's on the counter. Okay. It's pizza, where we put the pep and pepperoni. How can I help you? Hello? Uh, hello? Um, can, can I have some one cheese and pepperoni? Why, sure ma'am. Will that be one cheese and pepperoni pizza, or one cheese pizza and one pepperoni pizza? What? Ah, uh, did you want one pizza or two pizzas? Uh, two pizzas. Yes, ma'am. Are those large? Uh, yes, ma'am. Okay, so I have you down for one large cheese pizza and one large pepperoni pizza. Can I have your name for takeout? Uh, sure. Um, Mommy. Alright, Mommy. And, oh, I'm sorry. Just to make sure, are you positive that's the name that you want on your order? Oh, yes. Mommy always told us when we order stuff on the phone, we need to use her name. Can have it any way you slice it, I guess. Alright, um, your order will be ready for a pickup in about 15 minutes, and it'll be $12.16. Have a peppy rest of the day! Okay, bye! I don't ever want to do that again. I was so traumatized by this. I don't even remember if I said thanks. But I did have to do it again, and again, and again, because talking on the phone is just part of life. It doesn't matter if you're talking with your boss, or a distant relative, or a friend. If you haven't already, you are going to experience some awkwardness while talking on the phone. And if you haven't already, how? Here are some of the most common problems I've noticed that occur while talking on the phone. One mishearing or completely missing what someone says because either the phone cuts out or they didn't enunciate. And then she was like, Jelly, run her tea back. <laughs> um, sorry, I, I didn't catch that. What did she say? Yeah, she was like, Jelly, run her tea back. Can you believe that? <laughs> yeah, I know. It's crazy, man. So after hearing about that, what do you think about it? Uh, yeah, th th that's, that's crazy. Two, long, awkward silences when you've run out of things to say. So, yeah, the, um, that one time we hung out two weeks ago, that was fun, right? Yeah. We ate at, uh, uh, we ate at that one place. Y yeah, the one with the good burgers. That, that was pretty cool. Yeah, that was cool. And number three, not knowing when to hang up. It was so nice to hear from you today. Yeah, you too. Um, so today's pretty busy and yeah, yeah, I wouldn't want to keep you from it.
Yeah, cool. So, um, we should probably talk more later then. Yeah, it was nice hearing from you. Yeah, you too. Okay, um, talk to you later. Bye. And on the subject of phones, you see this ancient piece of technology? It is not, in fact, an indestructible calculator with a tiny screen and impossibly small keys, as it seems. No, I use this to call and text people and occasionally... No, it's pretty much all it does. While literally, not figuratively, all my friends and acquaintances have smartphones, I still have what my family refers to as a dumb phone. And you know, I'm okay with that. Sure, it does nothing to make the torment of talking on the phone easier, but it gets the job done. Just thought I'd share in case you saw my phone during the video and thought to yourself, Good heavens, what is that archaic technology? That is my cellular device. Tell me, what is the most awkward phone call you've ever had with someone? Now you are free to go. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And remember, Keep on imagining. Boing, boing, boing.